Hey there, geeks and geekettes. Tim Tibbetts with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you eight ways to open Task Manager. And as I was doing this video, I realized it's actually 10 ways, but all of them are easy to do. It all depends on how you want to get at Task Manager. Let's start with the keyboard shortcuts. They're always easy to do. Let's start with press Control, Shift, Escape. If you've never done that before, just press them in order. Press Control, hold it. Press Shift, hold it. Press Escape, hold it. Now, you may be looking at the fewer details pane by default if you haven't used it in a while. Go ahead, if so, and click More Details. This will be your default view, however you leave it. So I'm going to leave this here just to show you that. Another neat keyboard option, which I do all the time out of habit, is Control, Alt, Delete. So once again, press Control, Alt, Delete. And there is Task Manager. Now, as you can see, we're back to the view I left it at. You really want this view because that's going to let you get at all the details, performance, app history, startup, users, details, and services. All right. Let's try Windows Key Plus X. If you've never used that before, that's a great one. If you find yourself going into Control Panel or Settings in the case of Windows 10, as you may or may not know, this has access to the most popular stuff it uses. You can see it all here, Apps and Features, Power, Device Manager, PowerShell, but most importantly for us, Task Manager. There you go. Let's scroll on down. Is that the end of that one? Oh no, we're going to do the search. So you can press your Windows key plus S, or if you have search open, you just start typing Task Manager and you're going to look for it to appear here. T-A-S-K. There it is. Now here's the additional two options. Obviously you can click this. You can also run as administrator, but maybe you want to pin it to start. Maybe you want to pin it to the taskbar. Let me show you those. That's the two additional. There is your task manager. If you use your start menu frequently, I use this a lot. There it is. So there's a couple other ways. Change your mind, right click, unpin, start, unpin. There you go. Let's go to the taskbar. I like this too. All you gotta do is find a blank area right here. Right click. There it is. Like that. That's probably one of the easiest of them all if you're playing with your mouse a lot. Now the executable. This is kind of we're getting a little odd now, but that's okay. You can use launchtm.exe or taskmgr.exe. I'm going to stick with that. Those are the executables. That adds three more steps. Windows key plus R. That's your run. Control V or type in task mgr.exe and it doesn't have to be capital it can be lower press ok or click enter I'll click ok for now there it is you can do it in search there it is and from the command prompt or PowerShell because everything works from there now you might have noticed a little while ago I kind of mentioned command prompt or PowerShell Let's do Windows key plus X and let's do PowerShell. You can type it or you can copy and paste. And there it is. So that's kind of neat. So there's eight slash 10 different ways to open the task manager. Of course, these little shortcuts down here tend to be my favorites. And of course, the keyboard shortcuts, but try them all. See what feels natural to you. And once you find something that you really like, you can just stick with it. You're good to go. There you go. Eight different ways to open Task Manager. As always, the little logo's popping up down here, begging you to click on them because you can't do a video without saying, please subscribe. Thanks for watching. See ya.